All right, guys, welcome back to another episode of Dragon Fist Ultra Combo. So we're going to go into the daily summons where we can do a free summon and see what we get. So we do get 20 shards of Master Roshi right there, so that's pretty nice. And then, as always, we'll do the food summons also. Now, this episode is going to be more of, like, upgrading my characters, just looking at the, the gear and biography, maybe a fight or two in the arena. Um, there is an event going on with Janumba, so if you spend the most Dragon Stones, you will probably... You will get, um, I think, 250 shards uh, of him if you spend the most, along with, I think, his weapon that um, you can awaken. So, th so his ultimate move would be um, enhanced. So now right here, we're going to uh, rank up the Fat Boo. So he's at purple 3. Uh, a couple other characters we have here. I have the Boo Tanks, Kid Boo, and the Hit at purple 4. So I'm looking to rank them up uh, in the future. Because I don't have any characters at uh, orange, obviously, so I want to see um, how they'll be enhanced. And um, yeah, so the lineup is looking pretty okay. It's working out um, decently. I do have the uh, the Majin Vegeta. I'm still upgrading on the side just in case I want to maybe replace um, replace the Super Saiyan Vegeta with the Majin Vegeta. But um, it's always good to have flexibility in your lineup. So you see right here, I've been slowly ranking him up. Nothing crazy. Maybe like once a day, I'll probably try and rank him up. So right now he's only sitting at blue too. So here's the Janumba event I was talking about. I've only just done the free summons for it or the free spins, whatever. I I don't think I'd be able to if even if I did waste my 9,500 Dragon Stones, I don't think I would even make top 10. So I'm definitely gonna save up again for um, probably. Uh, I mean Janumba is still a good character because he increases his crit rate and his crit strength. So um, the damage he's gonna do is pretty insane. But I just don't think I would probably crack the top 10. That's why I'm still gonna be sa um, still be saving my dragon stones, and I know it could be hard because I want to spend it too. But uh, I'm gonna wait for uh, um, maybe a different character to come out and spend it on that, so I can for sure get that character. Because I think the second character you can get is Kaba, and I really don't want to get Kaba. But um, yeah, so now we're in the uh, trial. So we got um, injured 18, 20 shards of her, which is pretty nice right there. Now they're doing a cross server war, we're going against server 13 and we're pretty much winning right now. It is kind of hard to find someone to fight that isn't in my server so you don't get any plunder points or whatever it's called. So I don't see, I don't see it, um, yeah you can get more energy if you're ranked higher up, I just don't see the purpose in just fighting people on my own server. So I'm probably not going to end up finding a fight, but um, when I go to the shop and you redeem the points, I've been just using them, using them on Jirin and also his weapon. Uh, that's mainly what I use it on just because you can't farm Jirin elsewhere right now. So I know the Kid Buu you can also buy in here and the Maja Vegeta, but you can farm the Kid Buu in the Elite and you can get the Maja Vegeta in the, I think, Arena or the Alliance points. So yeah, so you see we all got compensated for the Jirin. That we all have at least 50 shards of him and now i'm probably going to jump into the future saga right here so you see in all features the bottom on uh, all features zamasu increases uh the damage rate i think it said so basically when you get it further up into that and you get like zamasu he'll be doing more damage etc so let's hop into this uh biography throw in hit and maybe another character or two throw in cell and i use like a lower end character here just because i think we're around the same cp and yeah, that should be good enough for this. ふふふふ。<笑><笑> All right, so we get the biography level up there. Now, because we're taking a little um, difficult stage, it's not the easy stage. So I think this one right here might be a little difficult because we only get to use three character slots. 
So I am using my one of my best characters um, in Boo Tanks and the Super Saiyan Vegeta. So I'm um, still lower CP. Um, so we're gonna see how we're gonna do here. Alright, so we did lose there, um, which I did figure, but that's alright, so we're on level 6 of that, we'll probably collect some rewards right here. Then we're probably going to go check out the gear of my Buhan, I'm a Buhan Babu tanks and Kid Buu. So let's see the gear. So everything's sitting around level 70 and 65, I'm um, probably going to upgrade that other gear right there to level 70. And the Kid Boo's gear also, I'm going to upgrade that to level 70. So that's pretty much the max right now I can do because my level is level 70, so I have to wait until I get my my actual level higher. And then um, we'll be able to upgrade these to level 75, etc. So you see the Evil Energy, ex just Esther Karika. So that's giving 40% extra HP, which is good the hit so everyone's gear is pretty much around purple three um, I'm slowly upgrading the fat boost gear so we might need to do a gold trial or something so we'll do that now and make sure to like comment subscribe guys for uh, more comment on dragon fist ultra combo leave a comment on your lineup right now ふざけちゅう。よっ。今の構えは。はあ。はあ。はあ。はあ。はあ。はあ。はあ。はあ。はあ。はあ。はあ。はあ。はあ。はあ。はあ。はあ。はあ。はあ。はあ。はあ。はあ。はあ。はあ。はあ
くだけ十円やっつかこりゃこりゃはまっときなふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふふAlright, so we did lose there,、uh, but it's alright, guys. That's pretty much gonna wrap up this episode of Dragon Fist Ultra Combo. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and as always, I'm out. Later.